Hello, my dear friend. Uh, this is Alexander from Shy Sky Tech. Uh, it is my colleague Lily who has communicated with you, yeah, through the messages on eBay and uh, sharing with you some photos there. Uh, regarding the 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 problem you have mentioned and uh, some updated information you shared with us, especially regarding that you have removed all the plastic material in the walls and the device can still not be powered on. Yeah. Uh, in fact, I I I I, can, I guess that I know uh, how this could happen. So in responsible attitude, I decide to ask our colleague in warehouse department to collect one set of the same WS six nine eight zero satellite final device, and uh, I decide to call this this uh, short brief demo video to share with you some information that I I know. Yeah, and uh, you can view, view it at the time of your convenience. I hope it can be useful. Uh, first of all, naturally, I share with you uh, the, the packaging. Uh, it is the same device, yeah. WS6980 model, and this is the device, and this is the ACDC power adapter. Uh, in fact, it is me who uh, placed the plastic material between the battery and the device before packing, because it is rather essential for keeping safety of device in the long time cross border transit process. After all, if the button was unintentionally triggered in the shipping process and it is wholly sealed, yeah, and the transit process may last a very long time, scores of days, and it is rather damaging to the device. Yeah, it is very hot if it is triggered and the battery is keeping on. So that's why we placed the plastic material as a physical obstacle between the battery and the device. Okay, uh, my friend, I guess that you already know that, yeah, to remove all the plastic material. Uh, let me still share with you once again. First, uh, press this, this button or this battery, of course. This is the original Cellink battery for the WS6980 device as shown on the in my hands and you can see there exists two metal uh, power connector. Yeah. Let's remove all this plastic material and uh, reinstall re reinstall this battery again. Okay. Uh, normally uh, let me introduce some background information. Uh, normally, when out of factory, the original Sunlink manufacturer may offer the may charge the battery with limited power inside because too much power inside, uh, maybe they feel they guess it could be a bit more dangerous. And after experiencing some time in stock and the long time shipment process, the battery may run out or nearly run out when arrival at receivers. So sometimes the battery may be zero and uh, I think that's the uh, that's, uh, cause why you can still power on the battery even you trigger the power on button. Uh, regarding this specific device, I suppose it is uh, it contains certain power inside. Let me have a check. But if not, uh, yeah. Okay, uh, this 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 device is with. Uh, let me have a check. Is with one bar battery, a power left in the battery, not too much. And if this device is shipped to some receivers and uh, after about 30 days the, the battery may run off its power. It may happen. So in that context <coughs> or in this context you are now encountering uh, the battery power may be zero and that's why even you power on it the, the screen is not on, right? In this context it's always, it's always our recommendation that our users 
the better use this matching ACDC power adapter device to to charge to charge the device lasting for about uh, uh, one to two hours one to two hours in advance of your use and you will find that the battery is with, with certain power inside and uh, the device can be normally powered on after you charge it yeah for some time uh, of course this this process shall be convenient and uh, let me let me do some brief brief uh, demo operation at my side okay now in this context I already plug the ACTC power adapter with the power cord yeah connection and I power on power off it uh, it's always recommended that device better be powered off when being charged when being charged yeah and uh, here I, I just uh, show a demo let me have a check uh, sorry uh, because I'm using my own hand to do that so it's a bit inconvenient I will release the cable or the power adapter to make it longer Co more convenient to be charged yeah and then i will take the device to some to some socket Yeah, I will I will put the socket plug with the with our AC AC power supply and then I will plug it to the to the socket. Uh let me pay some attention to the indicator light in this context. Yeah. It's plugged, it's plugged with the socket. And then this indicator, CHG charge, is on, is on. Uh, my friend, you can do this and keep the device being charged, lasting for about uh, one to two hours. Or in this context, yeah, you can try to, to, to trigger the power button. And in the, in this, in this way, you will see that the device can be normally powered. It's similar like the laptop, yeah, laptop. Uh, if the laptop's battery is running out, running off, it cannot be powered on. But if you plug it with the machine ACTC power adapter with effective AC power, then you can see the 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 laptop or this or this specific device will be on. And then we can we can see DWBS2, DWBT2, DWBC spectrum system setting etc etc yeah uh in fact before running this cement i i guess that we have already preset that we already preset the system setting the country as grace and uh, although it doesn't matter much because it's just a name it doesn't impact the inner database yeah and uh, regarding the database that have already been pre-installed it is currently the newest version of database for the European and Middle Eastern region so it will be quite convenient to be used uh, as the same as various other users located in UK France Germany Italy and other Greece Greek 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 users yeah and uh, this DVBS2 DVBT2C yeah etc Furthermore, the Greek language is also supported if you set it, yeah. And uh, you can you can charge the device lasting for one to two hours, and you can view whether the CHG indicator is on when the plugging is connected. This this 
indicator will be on after seconds after seconds of plugging and uh, as we can see the battery power now is show, showing uh, increasing right now it's one bar and now it's two bars correct okay my friend i will leave this device for being charged for a certain time uh, maybe half an hour or one hour and then i will get it back to the warehouse hope this short demo video can help in some way thank you bye bye